are here in Foxborough for today's game from Gillette Stadium. We're here today for our third broadcast of the season. Both of these teams ready to add a victory to their record as the Jets square off against the Patriots. Al Michaels and John Madden here to broadcast this one brought to you by EA Sports, the company that defines football. You talk about a quarterback who can lead his team to victory. This guy has all the tools you look for. Great arm, pocket presence, and the ability to hit a receiver anywhere on the field. There's not too many like this guy, and we can see him put up big numbers in this one. The Patriots have some good receivers, too, and it's a big reason for his success passing. Now, this is his favorite target, and when you see what he can do with a football in his hands, it's easy to understand why. The coaches have told us that they wanted to get him some catches early in the game, so we'll have to see if they stick to that game plan. Well, this guy's got to be careful not to get all tired out doing that. you got to save some of that intensity and energy for the game. Let's go to midfield for the coin toss. Let's get back to the action on the field. Benetieri in to kick this one off. Nice distance. The offense heads out onto the field for the first time. Only one man in the backfield. Set. Throwing on first down. Under pressure. Gets the pass off. He goes down at the 31. Perfect pass. Great catch. And that'll move the chain. The quarterback gets set with only one back behind him. So they'll lose yardage on that tackle by O'Gunlay. Great athletic ability allowing him to get to the quarterback for the first time today. Now in second and long after the set. Get in there. Closing in. Steps up. He'll get some extra attention now that he has two sacks. They'll be looking at third and long here. Set. Dropping back. Stepping up. Gets the pass off. This pass is incomplete. He just couldn't hold on to that pass. He has the hands to make catches on the toughest passes. I'm a little surprised to see him drop that one. Fifth play of this drive. Get at him, Chief. You got him. Let's go. Come on. Drops back. Pressure. Stepping up with the throw. And it's caught. Now I've got the question going through. The coach has decided to take advantage of his ability to challenge a bad call right here. Yeah, the NFL wanted to make sure that there was never any questionable calls. They determine a winner and loser at the end of the game. That's why they put the rule in. The call from the field stands. New England will be charged with timeout. Well, after taking a long look at the replay, he didn't see anything to change.
will go back to the play on the field. It's first and ten. Martin. Nice play for it. Gets the pass off. Posey with the stop at the 34-yard line. They brought the heat, but it was a good throw. They knew the defense was coming on a blitz, and when the pressure doesn't get to the quarterback quickly enough, somebody's going to be open downfield. And that's exactly what happened on that play. That's the toss to the left. A couple, maybe three yards on that run. Can't figure this one out, but they just backed up their corners and safeties, even though they'll probably see a run here. Gets rid of it, grabs the off-target pass. Now this is one heck of a play. Look at it. They're in a hole here on third down, and they come through with this perfect play that gets them a first and keeps the drive going. They got it. Drops back, Mark. Middlebrooks takes him down at the 16. A gain of around, let's call it four on the draw. With the throw, far with a hot hand on this drive. And what he's doing is sitting back there in the pocket, seeing everything making great decisions and getting the ball to the right guy. He's playing very well right now. Man in motion. Dropping back. Pressure coming. Goes to the end zone. Looking for the touchdown on first down, but couldn't get it to his target. So it's second and goal. Ball on the nine-yard line. The corners playing off a bit. Takes the toss to the left. Touchdown, Jets. And he takes it in for the score. I didn't think he was going to get much. The next thing you know, boom, he's in the end zone. Benetieri comes in to attempt the point after. And it's up. The extra point attempt is good. So they were able to use their great field position and drive the short distance to get into the end zone. Whether it's your special teams or defense that sets you up with great field position, your job as an offense is to take advantage of it. And they did it right there. From the eight-yard line. It's still very early, but this is one of those spots where you'd like to be able to respond and put the ball in the end zone. Gets the pass off. He hits his receiver. And he stopped at the 41-yard line. They'll head right back to the line. The Patriots using motion. Under pressure, stepping up, throwing, still running. Stiff arms the defender to the ground. Quarterback lets it go and it found its mark. This is one of those guys who's always had a pretty good arm. He always seems to do a good job of reading the defense. Stay up, yo. Directing traffic. That's all you. You got it. Yeah. With the pass. Pass ball's incomplete. That one hit him in the hands, but he just couldn't hang on. Pretty good play call on that one. Everything happened just as it's drawn up. Just couldn't hang on to it. The Patriots line up with two backs behind the quarterback. With the carry. Gain of about one. This is the fifth play of this drive. Let's go, come on. Closing in, looking downfield, looks to the end zone. He made the catch. Touchdown, New England. And he's able to get open in the end zone. Great play. Defense just seemed to lose track of him down there. They have to do a better job keeping the play in front of him so that that kind of thing doesn't happen. Christie comes in for the extra point. The kick is up, and the extra point is good. What well, you can't ask for much more out of a drive that gets you into the end zone. The thing that most impressed me about that last drive was the offensive line. 
They did a good job controlling the line of scrimmage, keeping their quarterback healthy and on his feet. A strong offensive line is the first and most important component to an effective offense. From the four, the 30, the 40, the 50. The special teams unit did a real nice job picking up their blocking assignments on that play. And I'll tell you, they created huge lanes for them to run right through. Seven defensive backs in on this one. They'll pass on first down. Throws it. Incomplete. It looked like he'd come up with it, but he just couldn't get it under control. He did a nice job of getting off the line and getting into his pass pattern. But he had the ball bounce right off his fingertips. Press coverage on the outside. Bulldog under. Fakes the throw. Pressure. Slings it. He's always very composed in the pocket, John. Nothing rattles him. Yeah, when you talk about guys that can handle the pressure and find the open receiver, this is the kind of guy you're talking about. Far sets up. The defense is going to play this one very tight. Nice play fake. Flings it to the outside. Into the open. They're trying to get the fullback involved in the passing game. And he's one of those guys who's a pretty good safety valve. He's got soft hands, and more importantly, he knows what to do with it when he gets it. Tightening up the coverage along the outside. Only one man in the backfield. Man in motion. Pressure coming. Throwing a strike to the end zone. Ooh, nearly picked off. Incredulous, he let that one go right through his hands. Yeah, you're not talking about a receiver either. That was about as close as you can get to an interception. He's got to make the play, especially down here in the end zone. Gets the toss to the right. Breaks free. This running back is more effective than some passing games. At the end of the first quarter, it's not enough. New England, seven. New York, seven. And we're ready to start the second quarter. New England presses its secondary up to be better prepared to stop the run. Hand it off. Just won't go down. Touchdown, Jets. Here's how they get in on that. They just can't bring him down. And he plows into the end zone for the score. They'll line up for the extra point. And it's up. And he catches on the extra point. Well, John, these teams are very evenly matched. This makes for a better game, I think. The strategy of the game comes into play here more. Should be a return here. From the two. And we'll see if they can move the ball as well through the air this time as they did after.